This is Claude Jones presents. I'm Claude Jones live from the Queens Classic Car Show. And we about to get started with some nice cars and classics and hear the good music and family settings. All right? So let's get live with the car shows that you see the cars and classic cars around Queens Classic Car Show. Claude Jones presents here on the Queen's Classic Car Show. We have a person with a classic car. What's your name, sir? How you doing? My name is Randy. I got a Chevy uh, Impala 66, 383 stroker motor in, frame of restoration. Did the interior, the top, everything was done. Okay. So uh, are you going to compete in this car show? I'm in, you know, I'm here for this car show, but I go around all the car shows, you know, the circuit, usually. Wait for the one that Archer Beach to come up next month. I'll be there, too. Okay, all right. Good luck with the cars. Coach, you a very nice classic car. Thank you. All right. All right, bro. All right, we're now here live with Claude Jones Presents. My name is Claude Jones. We're here with another competitor for the Queen's Classic Car Show. Yeah, my name is Sean Lomax from Mount Vernon, New York. Uh -huh. Here with my 1970 Vertible Buick Electric 225. Okay, okay. So, so give me some intro, what's so special, what's so special about this car? Uh, yeah. They're kind of rare, you know, okay. convertible. Okay. Clean, super clean, if you can uh, see. Okay, all right. Um, everything works, AC, everything works in it. All right, so. so get so, it and drive it anywhere. So, the, okay, so you got a nice classic car, the player yeah, car. Yeah, nice classic car. Yeah, yeah, player there car. There you go, they got to say it, that's I right. Go, I can go with that. They got to try to say it like that, man. <laughs> they got to say it, got a player car. I don't know what we're looking at this. You got to say that, man. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> all right, we here right clean, another classic car. Take a zoom of this car here. You know what I'm saying? You see a lot of this car in the future, the road area? The player's car, all right? <laughs> there we go. All right, bro. All right, <laughs> Here we got another, another competitor for the Queen Classic Car Show. Induce yourself. My name's John Allen. I'm here with the Mount Vernon Classic Car Club. This is my 1964 and a half Ford Mustang. Okay. okay. Notchback. All right. All right. Uh, she's one of the first that was produced. This one was produced in June, 1964. Okay. Got a 260 V8 engine in it. She runs like a dream. Okay. And she's my pride and joy. All right. All okay. Right. I, Okay, so tell me something special. Do you get chased a lot by the cars or cops? Uh, like your car or what? Oh, I love this puppy. By the way, she's been on the road three weeks. This is week number three. <laughs> all right. Yeah, all right. All right. So, you okay, know. That kid, I'm just good, dude. Another competitor. Yeah. Has a classic car. Yeah. It, it, it's a chaser, huh? It's a chaser. It, 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 it not only will chase them, uh -huh. it'll outrun someone. All right. I, I'm about to do him. All right. <laughs> all right. I ain't scared. Here it is. Here it is right now. Good, good competitor. They ain't scared. All right. All right. All right then, bro. All right. Another career classic co competitor. Moving on down. <laughs> this is Claude Jones presents. You about to roll with another competitor. What's your name, sir? My name's Black, bro. My name's Black. Uh, this is your car? Yes, sir. What kind of car is it? It's a Chevy Caprice. Chevy Caprice. All right. What year is it? Uh, it's uh, 87. Oh. 1987. Yeah, well, so, give me the sound of the knife. What kind of engine you got? Well, I got 350s. Stop. You know, got 30 inch rims there. Um, you know, got a little, I got three bars inside. You know what I'm saying? You can look at it. Let's take a little walk around, look at this car. You know, if you look behind the seat there, you'll see the three bars in there. Oh! You know, got a couple of trophies, uh, you know, um, from Brooklyn. You know what I mean? Um, it's a player ball convention car, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, you know, right. doing what I had to do. All right, all right. You know, go to a couple of car shows, win a couple yeah, of trophies. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> um, you know. Shit. All right, this, 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 this is a very classic car here. It took me only like a year to put it together. You know, and I got the. Uh, what you want to do? The pickup there, yeah. Okay. That's an 85. You know? 
So same yeah. kind of interior, huh? Yeah, same interior and everything. Yeah. Stock motor, 350. You know? Took a little eight months to put this one together. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay, okay. You know? Yeah, you, you, get down, you be down in the, in the, in the uh, convention down in L.A., the Playboy convention, uh, yeah. yeah? I could be there. <laughs> Yeah, well, you know, and then the guys we roll with, it's American old school. Uh -huh. As you see the stick on the front window, and there's a few of us. Well, there's a lot of us. It's about 30, 40 of us. Okay. And we just ride out. We're not a car club, but we just get together and we chill out, you know. All right. Come out on the weekends. That's what we do. Okay. All right. You know? well, well, this is another very classic car, very interesting cars you got here. Definitely. Okay. This is Claude Jones Presents, live for the Queen Classic Car Show. Claude Jones presents with another competitor for the Queen Classic Car Show. I'll be with Antoine Smith. Okay, Antoine, tell me about your car. Well, it's a 1971 uh, uh, Chevy Caprice. Um, I bought the car in March. Took me about three months to do the car the way I wanted to do it, but it, it wasn't. This wasn't the original color. I changed the color. It was green, okay. but it wasn't this green. It was like um, the green, of the, the the color of the interior. Okay. And um, I painted it. I did the motor tranny rear, All right. within the motor tranny rear within two weeks, and then took about another two week, two to three weeks to paint the car. He stripped it down bare metal. It was done right. The car run excellent, man. Okay. All right. Nice. The interior same way. The interior is all original. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, you can go in there. Check out the interior. Okay, that's definitely on, on on point. It's definitely on point. Definitely on point. All right, Antoine, you doing your thing, Antoine? Thanks, man. You know, it's hard work, and dedication, man. That's what this is a dedicated grind. If, if you ain't dedicated, then don't be in it. All but right. um, this is definitely what it's about, man. I got also 1987 Monte Aero Coupe coming out and next week. All right, then hit, hit, hit us up, man. I'll definitely hit you up. Okay. With the Queen Classic Car Show, we got some uh, people who don't know how they like the show. How you like the show so far? So far, I like the show so far. Good, you know. I've been started from over there and worked myself to the end, you know. And show my daughter for the first time, actually. Okay, okay. One of my youngest daughters. All right, all right. Yeah. You like the show? And okay, okay. And bring future wife, <laughs> bring future wife here with me. You like the show? Yeah, I find it quite interesting. <laughs> so far, she be driving up the lot soon. Yeah. <laughs> you got anything to say, Lundy? Huh? You don't want to say nothing? <laughs> All right, so you got anything to say? You, say you like the shows, like the cars? Yeah, man, I like it, man. What, what, what I, cars, I, I can't, what, what, I can't wait to get favorite? to the Mustang. The Mustang down there. Mustang, the, the, yeah, okay. the Mustang. I love Mustangs. All right, all right. Since my grandfather days, he showed me. He had the 5.0 GT Mustang. I think it was 96, 97 or something like that. Two-door shit, man. All right, okay. From that time, Fell in love well, with man, Mustang. next time you're gonna be up here with yours, too, right? Yeah, be up here and show them mine. That's yeah. right. Yeah. This is Claude Jones Presents. And we're gonna live to some more cars. Claude Presents with Jose. Yeah, Jose. From, introduce yourself. Okay, I'm from uh, the group NYC American Old School. I'm from Brooklyn, New York. Uh -huh. And this is my 1983 Buick Regal Custom. Oh, all right. So give me, give me, give me what you did to it, what you traded, how you, it was like to be bought, how, what you do to it. Well, it was, it's a base model Regal, actually. It's a base model Regal. It's um, got a full three from a Trans Am in it, five heads from a Herso, 373 Posi, uh, seven, uh, 204 overdrive transmission from a Grand National. It's kind of a, a mutt, but um, at the same time, the car, is, everything works into place with the, the car, the way I built it. It's all custom, so it, it, whatever you name on it, it's been changed, LED, headlights, taillights, whatever. You can't find a part that wasn't changed. Yeah. Your artwork too? Your artwork yeah, too? Air, uh, brushing on the hood too. It's got the war zone from the Punisher, from the movie. So that's um that's why the license plate says war zone on it. So it's a lot of custom work, it's, you know. It's what most of the guys in here do. Some of them must go a little overboard, but our wives don't like it, we don't care. <laughs> Yeah, it's, 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 it's definitely a supernatural kind of car. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> definitely, man. Yeah. All right, all right, all right, then. We definitely enjoy your car there. Yeah. Um, Jose? Yeah. And we're going to keep going. We're moving on down. This is Claude Jones Presents. We're one of the competitors for the Cars Queen Class Car Show.
about your, tell me who you are, what's about your car? Uh, my name is Weldon Poe. This was my aunt's car. Um, this was her first and only original car. Um, she passed away about 10 years ago. And I thought that it would be a great uh, representation of her if I've kind of fixed it up and made it look nice for her. Okay. Uh, it's a 1966 Thunderbird. Oh, Thunderbird, okay. Um, and I love the car. It came from California. Uh -huh. And I'm just trying to keep it nice for a family um, memorable thing. Everything about the same. Everything is original. Everything's original. You can come take a look. Um, before she got sick and passed, um, the car, she got in an accident. She totaled the whole front, mm -hmm. and I got the whole front end replaced and had the car repainted. And um, this is the, it's always something to be done. Yeah. But I love it, and it's a representation of her. So I'm just here today. I'm not really entering, but just glad to be here. Okay. And like I said, this is something new for me. And I'm learning as I go. Okay. All right. Well, very, very nice car. Very Thank good. You. Thank you. Claude Jones presents. I'm Claude Jones. We have another competitor with the Queen's Classic Car Show. And introduce yourself. Uh, Adam Alley. Okay. Uh, explain about your car. Uh, this is a 1968 Chevelle with a 383 Stroker, 350 Trainee, Posse Rear, everything in the car brand new. Power windows, power seats, power door locks. Completely uh, modified to be up to date. Uh, interior same way? Everything. Everything, super nuts. Let's take a look at his interior. Claude Jones presents. We got a judge for the Queen Classic Car Show. Induce yourself from left to right. Okay, I'm Brian Rowland. Okay. James Pringle. And Tracy McNeil. How long have you been judging? About the fifth what? show? Six show. Six show, yeah, about the sixth show. Last six years. <laughs> it started out here in Queens, okay? Okay. Coming to Queens Classic all the time. This is our home base right here. Okay. Right here in Roy Wilkins. Okay. Cut it. All right. <laughs> okay. okay. Thank you very you much. Gotta hit the button on that dude, man. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, just get it. Claude Jones presents. We are the Queen's Classic Car Show with the president. Introduce yourself. Gordon Duncan, president, Queen's Classic Car Club. And who are you? Jameson Jones, IT, Queen's Classic Car Club. And who are you? June Bartlett, vice president, Queen's Classic Car. So how do you start the club? Club started uh, six years ago, actually seven years ago, uh, with a car show that the Southeast Queens Park Association wanted to run, and. Um, the show was then taken over by us, and we formed a corporation, and um, this is what we have now for the last five years. Okay, okay. So you got how many members you got? We have 25 active members. Okay. So you compete around to the boroughs, or is it we just we have this one big car show here, and we do another one either at Pep Boys in Elmont or at Calvary Baptist Church on New York Boulevard. How to contact? Guy Bro. How to contact you? Our website is Queens Classic Car Club Inc. Net. Okay, any phone number do we give out? 718-206-4444. Uh, okay. And with the president himself speaking about the Queen Class Car Show, Claude Jones presents. Okay. Thank you very much. The Claude Jones presents on the Queen Class Car Show. We won the uh, young ladies walking around. Tell me, explain you like the show. Well, I was invited and told to come here, and I'm fascinated by all the antique cars and, and just how they just, you know, they, they kept up and they're made and they're just restored. It's amazing. Okay, so can we drive one can we drive one soon, huh? I hope. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I hope to see you in the future to be a competitor when next car show. Okay. I'll be there. <laughs> All right. All right. The Claude Jones presents with one of the competitors for the car show, Queen Class Car Show. Introduce yourself loudly. All right, my name is King. I got a 1967 Mercury Monterey. I had the car for 10 years. I got it from Georgia, and now I brought it up here to New York, 
And I started a car club out here in Far Rockaway. We've been going like seven years strong. My car's legit, you can see how it is, you know what I'm saying? I'm representing. And I got the spinners on here too. You know what I'm saying? I, I, interior? Yeah, the interior was good. Interior, I did the interior over like five years ago. The interior was burgundy, so I changed it red to match the car. The whole car is red up, man. I had the car for 10 years. I'm just trying to keep it working, you know? Okay. Uh, what kind of contact number they can reach you? Okay, my contact number for my car is 718-216-2690. That's Universal Classic Car Club. All right, all right, bro. Like your car, you're doing the good big things. All right. All right. You, you Claude Chong presents. You YouTube it. Also, Tom one of Verizon. Thank you. Claude Chong presents. All right, peace. Here we go. Claude Chong presents. We got another competitor. I'm going to introduce yourself. Chris Hill, representing Far Rock Universal Classic Car Club. Got my 1970 Monte Carlo, Pepsi Blue. Got the blue interior, gator skin inside. Let's see the interior. You did it all yourself too? Yeah, I had everything done. Changed the rug, all the interiors, new seats. Took out the bench seats. These seats here recline. Uh, what, up, what else, what else? Blue paint we did, 22 inch rims, dubs. Mm. Wow. Five years in now. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. right. You hear this with another, another classic car? Doing things, Players Club. All right, bro. All right. Club Show on Presents. We have uh, another car competitor from, from the Queen Classic Car Show. Introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Tony Pedro. <laughs> All right, what we have here is a 1957 Corvette. Uh, it's kind of stock appearing. I call it a sleeper because it's got a 434 cubic inch motor, making almost 600 horsepower. I completely wow. changed the front suspension and the rear suspension so it drives like a dream. I literally drive it with these two fingers. I got a five speed of SS700 transmission that can handle up to 1,000 horsepower, 1,500 pounds of torque, uh, four link in the back, all the coilovers, wheel width disc brakes all the way around, and it's just a pleasure to drive. You know, all original gauges, everything works, even the original radio works, but I have a secret audio, so I got my, you know, I can play my music and get my boom on. Yeah, this car was a mess when I first got it. It took the whole car. family thought I was nuts when I brought this home on a trail. I pushed it in my yard July 26 of 2008. The interior was no the seats were all ripped up, the door panels, uh, they thought I was crazy. So here it is today. It took me about four years to do it. Wow. Very nice. Thank Very you. nice. Thank you. Claude Jones presents live with one of the car owners of a classic car. What's your name, ma'am? Andrea Williams. Tell me about your car, Andrea. I have a 1978 Caprice Coupe. Um, I've had it about 12 years, and I've done a lot of work to it. I had it painted. Um, it's actually given to me by my aunt, who passed away six months after she gave it to me. Okay, okay. So I've added a hood scoop to it. Okay. Um, I've added 373 gears. Okay. And I did the interior electric blue. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You did the interior also. Let's look at the interior. I have the interior done in electric blue. And I changed the steering wheel. I put a tack inside and I changed the radio and, you know, put a system in here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow, you did, did big things up here. Yeah. All right, the chase, all right, do your thing then, bro. Thank you. I mean, another nice classic car at Queen Classic Car Show. All right, thank you very much, ma'am. Have a good day, guys. Okay. John presents, and we've been a day shooting with the Queen's Classic Car Show, and uh, we had a nice time, family outing, 
Real good cars, a nice cars. And I'm looking forward to next year of uh, doing the Queen's Classic Car Show again for my show. Claude Jones presents YouTube it on Verizon channels and Time Warner Tuesday nights at 8.30 p.m. Claude Jones presents Queen's Classic Car Show. Peace.